Hello YouTube, uh, back with another video, and right now I'm just about to start episode 5-1, or 51. It's the, one of the DLC missions that come with the premium edition, or just day one DLC in general. I found out when I was recording my videos that I was having a little bit of trouble uh, getting it picked up. So I'm not sure what's what's up, but you know, I'm adjusting my my uh, volume right now, and hopefully this time you'll be able to hear me better. Though maybe it might blow my eardrums while I'm playing this, but you know, necessary sacrifices. So right now, there's not much uh, left to do unless I want to focus on doing Mondo Girls, but I want to save that for later. So for now, I'm just gonna go right into episode 51, and I'm just treating this as happening after episode 5, you know, just for the sake of convenience. So, the man who stole blood. Well, let's get to it. just drank from a pure blood vampire. I hope you're prepared for the consequences. Pure blood? Witness the power of a pure blood. never turn away any clients from our office. I mean, in no disrespect whatsoever. Shouldn't you go to a hospital? There's no need. I'll be back to normal in less than a week. Please, execute this man. Understood. to stay alive looking like that. Huh? It's said that vampires can regenerate, even if they're left with only a single finger, should the conditions be right. It's true. I am a vampire. One who coexists with humanity. And is this man a vampire as well? No, not this man. Normally, when a half-breed sucks the blood of a pure-blood vampire, he cannot live. He is something much more vile. Something that should not even exist. Mondo, what do you think? Can you do it? Of course. My left hand and a bloodsucker. We'll see who ends up on top. This is pretty goth. This is lovely! I want to be a prison in a castle like this one! Someone, I beg thee to carry me up into yonder tower! Mika, go round back. We'll split up and take care of this. <laughs> Your opponent is a vampire that survived for hundreds of years. We don't know what he's got in store for us. Be careful. The job? Killer is dead. 
I'm gonna have to figure out what he means by that grammar. This fog is a nuisance. Since you can't see very far, proceed with caution. Such perfect timing. Could these guys be Sebastian's henchmen? <laughs> Just testing my shots. Sometimes it comes out of the after this. back here? Mm, seems not. Yeah, it's kind of dark in here right now. I can't really see. Hopefully this will be better when I replay this game on HDMI. Ugh, this guy. So sorry, but I'm totally clueless. Master, you lost consciousness after that tragedy. It undoubtedly caused you incredible pain. Tragedy. Master, it is dangerous if you try too hard to remember. Please let me carry you. Without my assistance, you will never make it to the castle. This is the Forest of No Return. The Forest of No Return? <laughs> that was totally an authentic boot screen. Name. Yeah. Did you go and find a girl named Mika? I'm pretty sure she's totally lost by now. As you As wish, you Master. Master. Still not sure what to say about a, having a unicorn for a pet. Whoa. Strange. That guy's on the right now. Then what exactly are they? Legendary vampires that have been given ancient times. That's the fact that they're allies. Younger. 
creature of similar background. This is a vampire console, all right. They just keep coming, don't they? I planned on dueling them with a bit of style, of course. My I'm not sure how to judge it. Uh, for me, it's more important to get money right now. But again, I don't know how judgments activate. What conditions does it require to kill somebody? Well, it's a good thing I have that auto healing thing for now. You wanted to see me? I knew you would come. You're free to stop by any time you want. I'll be waiting. There's something about the stage design of this game. It's kind of interesting how you just sort of, you know, they're more, they're literally, they're more like rooms. The, the fact that they're rooms instead of just chambers of all this furniture in the middle. I'm not sure what, how to exactly describe it, it's just kind of strikes me as... How long are you going to keep me waiting? It's well past our meeting time. It's kind of strange, I guess. I don't know what to say, it's just... <laughs> Sure, if I should. Which? Nah, I'm sorry. I guess I better check that for a moment. Well, break up those. Yep. Yeah, see, I kind of level up a little bit. This stage is kind of dark for me. Um, the the negative colors, maybe. How do you describe it? It is just kind of the shadows are
your promise, did you? I guess I have to revisit her soon. I wonder if she gets upset if I spend too long away or something. <laughs> it's pitch black in here. I need to watch where I step. It would probably be wise to light your way as you go. Didn't you bring something to make a fire with? Fire starting. Shooting doesn't seem to help. Maybe I lack the sub gun right now. That suck. I guess that's convenient. There's always the, the non obvious answers. Do this, it's a bit easier to see. Uh, wait, did I just go in a circle? I think I just did. This is the way forward. 
Still in the same place. Okay, maybe I should try that little portal fingers right now. Oh wait, no, I'm going full circles now. So I'm not really sure where I'm going right now. Let's see what my timing is. 22 minutes. So I'm still doing pretty good. Still confused as heck. This is one of the strange deals. Alright, so I don't know what that why let's do that. It was just to light all the torches. There's no. Mm, I'm not really sure if there's an objective marker right now. Two doors, and I just saw both of them. Seriously lost. I'm just kind of you know, this this sequence really does need some sort of objective marker or something that can be a tip. Right now I'm just sort of being lost. I mean you're just talking about lighting torches, but you know, is there any torch that I missed? Is there something that I've overlooked?
guess it all worked out for the best. They really keep a close eye on this place. For the first time, Sebastian probably feels afraid of me. No. everything. I think we can get out of the basement from here. I'm not sure where it leads, though. Well, hmm. Well, anyways, I'm hitting 29 minutes. I'm about to hit 30 min minutes. So I think this is a good time to take a... Uh, to pause the video here so uh, I'll stop here and then you I'll see you in the next video and conclude this DLC mission and maybe if there's time afterwards I'll just keep screwing around with the overworld side quests so let's just cut it short here and I'll see you next time until then signing off <laughs>